Hello! How are you guys? So, it's Wednesday. This is my second live of the day. Whoop, whoop! Um, a few things I wanted to share with you guys before we get into this, because I'm, I'm excited, um, but I'm also nervous. Um, a few things. So, number one, I am doing this really early tonight, and I know I am. Hi, Sammy. Um, I am doing this really early, and that's because my face is starting to freak out from all the videos I've been pre-recording. So, after this, I am taking everything off. Hi, Alyssa. I'm doing a nice skincare routine and really just, like, hopefully making my skin feel better. It is, like, freaking out. I'm breaking out, and that's mostly just because it's, like, so much on and off, on and off. So, we are going to get started. We're doing cupcake face. So, this is what my cousin Vanessa sent me a while back. For when I hit 300 likes on my business page. So 300 thumbs up. I'm super excited. Um, super nervous. But another thing too is I am 22% to green. Hi Emily. And I'm super like 22% to green. So for those of you guys who don't know. Green is like director level in uh, different businesses. Uh, green is one of the biggest things to hit. It's top 2% of the company. It's a huge deal. So I'm trying to go for it still. I want to hit it by my birthday, which is on the 30th. So we'll see what happens. So we're going to get started. I have nothing on because I'm going to really just make this work. Super pumped. All right. Hi, Abby. So we're going to start off with our glorious face primer because even though we're not doing much, I still got to put a little bit of a base on so we can really play around. There will be some non-unique products I'm using, but that's in order to really achieve what we want to achieve. Why did that make a weird clicking sound? So, and I'm wearing a tank top in my freezing cold basement because sometimes I'm like, I don't want to put too much stuff on because having so, like, doing looks like this, I just, it's easier to, like, strip down, if you will. Alright, so, we're just concentrating on this eye. Good afternoon. I almost said good morning. Good afternoon. So, eek. Eek. All right. Let's do some BB Flawless and some a little bit of concealer. So we're using Bisque. We're going to do a little bit of concealer in some color that I don't have in front of me. Um, please share this video with your friends if you haven't already. Um, I want to see how many, like, likes and reactions I can get to this, to this cupcake face I'm about to do. I like seeing how far it goes. You know what I mean, jelly beans? So, I'm just kind of getting my base all set up. Gotta do a little bit of honey. But, yeah, so hitting green is a really big deal in my company. And I really, really want to hit it for my birthday. Top 2% of the company. Um, get to walk stage at convention, which I have my ticket for. So, going to San Antonio. San Antonio. In, when am I going? In, uh, in August. So, I'm really freaking pumped. My mom and my grandma are coming with me. Um, so we're going to have a grand old time. We'll be there for about a week. But convention's only like three days. But I like making like a trip out of it. Because I've always wanted to go to Texas. So I'm like, make a week. Overlooks the historic Alamo. Where we're staying. I'm going to be using this palette a lot. Because... We have a lot of colors to mix and blend to be sure we get it. Okay. I don't like going this live this early when I'm doing something like this, but I'm also making dinner tonight. So I'm kind of in charge of damn. All right. Let's do this. Let's do it. So we're going to start off with outlining everything because if you don't outline it it's not gonna look right so we're gonna outline everything so we're gonna outline with a brow pencil no no with a brow pencil I need my black eyeliner 
Where is my black eyeliner? I'm going to start off with that. Of course, I, I, you know, I tried to prep everything too, like have everything out. So like I had it. I didn't do it very well. All right. So we're going to use a brow pencil, which is fine. It's really just, we're shaping everything out. All right. So she's got it like coming up. The cupcake. Wow, this is a really light brow pencil. All right, so then she's got it kind of like wavy. I should have tagged my cousin Vanessa in this. I did not do that. That was dumb of me. And then like wavy. <laughs> and then the frosting part, which is going to go up further on my head than on hers, but it's okay. It looks like a baby bottle. Alright, lips are going to be last. <laughs> They're definitely going to be last. And then she's got like a swirl here. I like mapping it out. I need to know where I'm putting everything. Okay. Okay. I think we just need to dive in. Now that I have like the general idea. Okay, so we're going to start off with the eye. So I'm going to use Addiction Palette 5. It's got a lot of the colors in it that I need for this look. So using Addiction Palette 5, I'm going to clean off this brush super fast. This is like the brush I want. Okay. I hope this turns out good. I hope so. I hope it does. All right, so she's got it like inner corner. So I'm using Addiction Palette 5 with that bright yellow Vindictive that we have. Yeah. It's not as bright as I would like it, but Alive isn't this bright either, so we don't have that bright, bright yellow, but this will do. This is good. So who's excited to see how this comes out? I'm excited and nervous. So I'm using, this isn't a unique blending brush, but it is a really good blending brush. It's by Simple Techniques, Real Techniques? Real Techniques, Real Techniques, not Simple Techniques. It's by Real Techniques. <laughs> I think I'm going to need a splurge in a minute. All right, so we're going to stop there with that for now. And then we're going to do, I think I need a splurge for part of this. I'm going to use Rapturous. Yeah, we're going to get the purple in. Get that purple. Oh. Itchy nose. Okay. This is Rapturous Splurge Cream Shadow. It's a really pretty deep purple. My nose is so itchy. And start bringing that down. So something I keep getting tagged in this past week, I'm not kidding, like several people tagged me in the same exact thing on um, the dick liner post that's been going around. I got tagged and asked to do a, or just, I don't know if it was out of jokes or what, but the dick liner, like your eyeliner, but it's a penis. Um, I don't think I'm going to do that. <laughs> Only because I know there's a lot of kids who watch this. And I know I just said the D word on here. But I do know a lot of kids watch this. And I'm not going to 
do something like that. It's funny, but I just can't bring myself to do that. And I hope you guys understand. So, I mean, it would be funny, but I'm not going to do it. <laughs> All right, now let's see here. Let's get the let's keep working on the inner corner here this is gonna be one of those like all over things because I just don't know where to start there's just so much going on I'm like oh, I have no clue where to start so we're gonna make it up as we go yay all right oh man that fell when I didn't want it to there we go also I may have to keep this on while I until everyone in my family comes home because it'd be really funny. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's the brush I want. There we go. All right, so now we're going to use this bright orange here, which I don't think I've ever used. Vintage. I don't think I've ever used vintage. And it's like... Right in there. So this is vintage that we're putting on. Let me see if I have, let's try this. We're gonna use a little bit of splurge in Defiant. See if we can get that to brighten up a little bit more. Yes. Much better. Even though I know that's going to have to all turn to white in a minute. If I can move the cupcake over. So. Oh boy. Alright, so next up we're going to do the white. So I'm using um Scarlet Concealer for the white. Because Scarlet is a pretty light color. I don't, we have a white pencil, but it's not as light as I would like it to be. So I'm going to use Scarlet Concealer to get that pencil, to get that white look. So using that, ooh, here we go. It's like inner corner there. Oh boy. And it like kind of comes up. See what I mean? It's light enough where it's okay. I'm going to start building the base. of the cupcake which has shrunk down a little bit <laughs> hi Mandy Okay, that's tough. All right. Whew, I'm like concentrating to make sure I get this right. This is like a really tough look. Okay, so we have, that's the white part. I'm trying to make my brows as light as possible. I think I might add glitter to make that like a little better as I once I start getting closer to the finish up. All right, so then the brown color, I'm using our concealer in. I believe I'm using it in suede. I think it's suede. Yes. 
it is suede. So this is our concealer in suede. I only need like the littlest amount. Our concealer goes a long way. So I'm going to use, it's like barely coming out. This is fun. My mom used to say to me, she's like, why are you wasting so much makeup? I'm like, I'm not wasting makeup. I'm just having fun with it. All right, so for the chocolate, top of the cupcake. This is kind of like the ice cream one I did a while back, which was really fun to do. Really not fun to take off, but I did um, an ice cream one a while back. So it's a little similar to that. I did it around uh, Halloween time. So this one's just a little different. It's less full face. The other one was more full face, which was interesting. And somehow I managed to get an ice cream cone to stick in my hair. So that was pretty cool. I'm trying to sharpen this pencil. So I managed to get an ice cream cone to stick in my hair. So that was pretty cool. Come on, dude. All right, here we go. Going back under. I got asked a lot, like, how did you do that? And I, like, strategically put, like, a bobby pin, <laughs> like, in the ice cream cone <laughs> to get it to stay. It was very difficult. All right. So we're going to use two Splash Liquid lipsticks. We're using Stately, which is a maroony color. I'm trying to make sure I get enough of it out. I like this color a lot. I use it a lot. So a maroony color. And then we're going to use Superb, which is the hot pink color we want. So using these colors to really make that a cupcake. The cupcake duck! What do I want to use? I need a brush. Here we go. All right, so we're going to start off with the nice hot pink. And then we're going to mix that with a little bit of stately. To get the darker color toward the bottom. And a little bit of the darker sheens. Darker shades throughout. So it starts to get a little texture. Uh, I don't want that there. Alright, then I'm going to take some superb or stately with the brown and do the same thing. It's like painting, you know? So it's like painting. You just gotta like the lights and the highs and the lows. You just gotta play with it as you're doing it. So, um, this is fun. I love doing the crazy stuff though because it's just, it's different. And a lot of people have different reactions to it. You know, some people love it. Some people hate it. That's what happens. We're going to use a little bit of the... What is this? Scarlet again. So it looks like whipped frosting almost. Then 
There will be glitter involved though today too. There will be glitter. Oh boy. It's also really hard to do when you're looking in a mirror. Okay. Now that we've got that done, we're going to finish up some of the other pink. So there is a little bit more pink under my eye and throughout, so I'm going to use that. It's like right here. I'm really trying to copy this. Hi, Lexi. I'm really trying to copy this picture as best as I can. So hopefully no one says I failed it. Um, all right, so then I'm going to do the purple again. I'm going to bring that up a little higher. I have it too far down. So using Rapturous again. This is such an interesting picture. Hi, Laura. I am a perfectionist. I'm like really trying to make sure I follow this. <laughs> I don't feel like I'm like, I'm not capable to do it, like just come up with an idea like this. I don't feel like I'm capable to do that. So when I'm like copying something, I'm like, all right, I'm copying it, like copying it. So it's like overwhelming sometimes. All right, so I'm gonna take a purple shadow from Addiction Palette Five. which I'm like running out on. So this is Addiction Palette 5, it's my favorite palette. Well, one of my favorite palettes. And I know it looks scary, but let me tell you, the looks you can make with this are insane. Oh good, my mom's doing the dishes. I refuse to do the dishes today. I was like, I'm not doing them. I do them all the time. So I refused. Which is true though, I do do the dishes all the time. All the time. Alright, so I'm going to do the yellow a little bit more. Told you guys, I'm trying to... Trying to get this right. Alright, then what's next? Alright, so there's a little bit of the orange. Using my mermaid brush. So again, using Vindictive. Kind of messed that up a little bit, but that's okay. This is like too far down. That's okay. Mermaid brush. And then a little bit of Sarcastic. <clears throat> is up in that. Hi, Kim. You guys are awesome for tuning in, by the way. I love when people tune in. Um, for those of you who don't know, I was going to do this a little later, but my skin is freaking out with the amount of product I've had going on and off of it the last few days. So I was like, alright, we're going to concentrate on skincare when we're done with this. Really, like, sit down, put a face mask on, just, like, think about life. So, that's what we're doing after this. Alright, I need a little bit more pink under here. There we go. I am really excited to see how this comes out. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So next up. Let's see. Actually, we're almost like pretty close to done. I just got to do like the lips and like define everything a little bit more. So we're actually pretty, pretty okay. Um, what's next? I'm trying to decide. All right. I'm going to do the highlight on my cheek really quick. So I'm using a non-unique product. It's the Alme... Jelly highlight. I had to get it. It's jelly highlight. It's really cool. I really like it. So we're going to. It's like. It's really spongy. Woo! We're gonna. 
put some of that under here. It's just like, it's so weird. The consistency is so weird. But it's really cool. I kept seeing ads for it and ads for it and ads for it. And I'm like, all right, I really need to like see if this is like really good. And it's awesome. So I got two colors. Two colors. All right, now I'm going to use a little bit of blush on top of that. And then we're going to use a little bit of um, luminizer. So I'm using the, this is limited edition serene blush. This is back for a limited time only as we celebrate 1 million presenters. We're doing a special bundle, 1 million reasons to celebrate. And so they have brought this back. There are two colors you can choose from serene and spirited. This is serene. Spirited is much a deeper pink. Okay, so that's a big pink. And then, let's see. Where's my iridescent powder? I was like, I know I used it today. Here we go. Used it earlier. Interested in the blush? Okay, I'll message you after this. It's a really pretty color, right? <clears throat> All right, so then we're gonna use iridescent luminizer. I think I'm gonna need a little bit more of the blush. Just a little bit more. Trying to blend that out. Not blending how I wanted to. But that's okay. Alright. What's next? Lots of black eyeliner gonna go on here. Hi Michelle. Hi Brandy. A lot of black eyeliner about to go on here. Oh boy. So we're gonna use. I think I'm gonna want to use shadow at first. So I'm going to use shadow at first. So this is palette, not the palette I want. Where's the black shadow that I use all the time? Where'd you go? No. Ooh. This is it. Hi, Taylor. Hi, guys. All right, so we're going to use the, oh, I found the white pencil, though. Black shadow here because it's going to start getting really intense. And I'm also going to actually set this white with the white uh, press shadow that we carry. So I'm going to do that. So I'm going to start off by setting the white. I do some crazy stuff, guys. But it's fun. And I think this is coming out okay. What do you guys think so far? you want to see the picture again of what I'm trying to recreate just let me know I'm happy to show you thanks all right black eyeliner let me clean this brush off love our brush cleaner our brush cleaner is amazing all right so cleaning that off really quick because I want this kind of special tiny brush to really get in there Thank you, thank you. Love when you guys love what I do. Stick through all the crazy weird stuff I do. Yes, I will show the picture. Hang on. All right, so. Those of you just tuning in, this is what I'm trying to recreate. Slowly getting there. But getting there. There's just so much going on in like one little spot. I'm like, let's figure that out. So I'm making up it as we go sometimes. But she's got some pretty intense false lashes going on too, so. Phone call, sorry.
So I'm using the Press Shadow in Legendary to try to Sorry, like sometimes when I'm like doing something, I'm like, I can't talk. <laughs> uh, so to try to get that shape going on, the wing. I never notice how baggy my eyes are until I have to draw under them. All right, so that wing, it's a pretty intense wing actually, so that's okay. All right, then I'm gonna do some shading around the edge of the cupcake. So you guys can see it's the cupcake wrapper. So it's going to be a lot of like defining the lines kind of thing now, but I can't wait to play with the glitter. So that's going to be fun. Oh boy. So it comes down like that. All right, let me try to get a different brush for that little part there. I need a different brush. Ooh. Trying to smoke that out a little bit. This is so intense. I think I messed that up a little bit. Oh, I have Q-tips. There. Okay. Okay. So I kind of cleaned that up a little. I moved the garbage. Um, putting on the false lashes is going to be interesting. Like, real interesting. And I don't think I mean interesting in a good way. Okay, so there's a little bit of shading around. Ooh, maybe I should stop using black and maybe use the gray. to get the nice light shading. There we go. Ooh, this is intense. I mean, it's pretty cool. At least I think so. All right, let's start. <sighs> let's play with glitter. Well, let me get a little bit more orange in there. I feel like the orange isn't popping up for me as nicely. So getting a little frustrated with that, gotta say. Let's see here. There we go. That's a little better, the orange showing up. Just like very dirty looking. I think it's just because I have so much going on, it's going to look a little dirty. That's okay. All right. Glitter time. Let me clean this off. It's kind of crazy 
looking. I'm just using a baby wipe to clean this off because I'm going to put all the glitter on it. So I'm going to mix the glitter primer with the glitter this time. See how well that works out. All right, so we got a bunch of glitter primer on there. Like so. So then this is, again, um, I'm using NYX products, okay? I'm using NYX products for the glitter. Um, cupcake glitter should definitely be this color. So we're going to start off with that. So the rainbow sprinkles, if you will. And we're going to use... This brush right here. Okay, cool. So we're mixing the glitter primer with the glitter. Hi, Destiny. So adding this on top of the cupcake, like sprinkles. So there we go, getting some glitter finally up in here. Because it does have sprinkles in it, but. I'm not using actual sprinkles. I used food products one time. And that was an ice cream cone. And I only had ice cream cones in my house because I just made my friends my best friend's daughter's unicorn cake, and I need ice cream cones for the unicorn part. This is the only time. All right, so we're going to do sprinkles down here. Hi, Ainsley. All right, so we got a little bit of the pink sprinkles down here. Now it's time to get into the blue sprinkles. Not the blue, the gold, the yellow, whatever it is. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so we're going to use the gold sprinkles I have. I haven't used these yet. We're going to use this fun brush. So dipping it in the NYX primer. And then the gold, like really into the gold. Then there's like a little bit here. I like playing with glitter. It's so much fun. Many of my friends may not agree, but I think it's fun. All right, and then we're going to do a little bit into the chocolate cupcake part. Okay, so that's the gold. And looking at my brushes right now, tomorrow's going to be a brush cleaning day see it already. All right, now it's going to be silver. I'm going to put a lot of silver on this because, hi Katrina, just because there's a lot of, how do I want to word it? Just because like the color isn't 100% how I want it to be, so we're going to put a lot of silver on that. So we're going to, oh boy, I try to use like the not so good brushes when I do this. But sometimes that doesn't happen. Ooh, this one's good. There we go. This one's a good brush, but it's, I don't know. It's like easier to clean, easier to work with.
So we're just kind of patting it in right now. And kind of whatever falls just falls. Just so you know, this is showing up a lot better like in person than on camera. Like I look like I'm drenched in glitter right now. All right, so there's that one. Then I think that's it for the glitter. Aside from when I do my lips. All right, so we're gonna do <sighs> false lashes. Where are my cheap ones? Cheap ones. Oh, you know what? We're gonna use these. These are like almost done. They're not super cheap, but they're at least like they're good for this purpose. You know what I mean? Except I feel like I need a little bit more black. So I'm gonna add a little bit more black up there. Um and I'm gonna use lash gel. I will say I was arguing with myself over whether or not I wanted to do the false lashes, so. Like, I forgot what I was doing already. Old age man. Alright, so we're going to use just a little bit more black up here. I can't swipe too much. Because of all the glitter. So, interestingly, as people tune in, Facebook says, oh, so-and-so is watching. Do you want to bring them on camera? I'm like, I'm sure they don't want to be on camera. But it's really funny because it's like, bring them on camera. And I'm like, no. I know they don't want to be on camera. <laughs> All right. So we're going to do, this is the top one. So this will have to go on as an actual false lash. I'm telling you guys, this is going to be an interesting thing to see. This is going to be interesting. Oh, wait. So I do have tweezers down here. I didn't know if I had tweezers or not down here. So we're going to do false lashes. Okay, so we're gonna let that get tacky. I'm gonna bust out a mirror. Little nervous, not gonna lie. Ask me when the last time I put false lashes on was a dumb long time ago. Well, actually, not really. I've been trying to practice with them more with all the weddings I have coming up. So, I'm trying to practice with them more. It's really hard. <laughs> all right, so now we have it. So, she's got one, like, underneath her eye. Like, that's weird. Like this. Okay. This one I might not need the tweezers for. These are more of like natural looking false lashes. Actually, I might need the tweezers. Oh, 
all weird. Because she's got them like underneath her eye. Trying to make sure they're like fastened. <laughs> that would be awkward. All right. Ooh. I will say I'm not 100% sold on this so far. Not 100%. All right, so we're gonna do just a little bit of black on top here. All right, um, lips. Okay, so we're gonna have to do a few things for lips, and that's gonna start off with, I'm gonna have to use Scarlet Concealer on my top lip to get that white out look. But I do, I did find my white pencil, so we can start off with that. So let me just sharpen it. I used it for something else at one point, because it's a little dirty. So using the white pencil, actually I might be able to get away with not using that. So we have the white on top, so I'm gonna add the glitter now. Where did I put my silver glitter? Where did I put it? All right, I won't do it then. I'll just do it now. And it's like dripping. So it's like dripping down. Hi, Rachel. This is interesting. All right, let's get the top of our lips glittered. Like sprinkles. Thank you. Like, not 100% sold on it. I'll be honest. Like, I like it, but I'm like, hmm. Alright, so then we have the glitter on top of our lips. This is so weird. I have false lashes, like, under my eye. I have false lashes falling off of my eye. We're almost done. There's like glitter everywhere. Come on, pop up. I'm trying to like make sure I'm getting most of this correct. <laughs> yeah, I think I got it. I think I got it all. I just want this to be brighter. Let me see if I have anything to make that brighter. Like color wise brighter. I could do a little defiant. Even though it's the, it's like the, it's not the color we want, we could still use. It's 
okay. That's a little better. Let me see if I can find extravagant. Oh, treasured, treasured, treasured. Forgot about you. Let's try this color. Treasured. This is the yellow we should have used. <laughs> she says in hindsight, when it's all almost over. Yes. This is exactly what I needed. My husband's home. I can hear his truck. we go that's the yellow I wanted lesson learned big lesson learned big mistake huge hi Tiffany hmm. all right gotta say it's okay it's not bad it's not terrible Definitely not one of my favorites, but it's not bad. Just gotta like do my hair like how she's got it where she's all like <laughs> covering half her face. So cupcake face. Uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you haven't liked my business page yet, it's um, Alana's Unique Beauty. I just realized as I press play that I totally forgot to put the little tag in there. So I'm sorry. Um, if you guys have any questions at all about any of the products, let me know. And in the meantime, hope you guys have a great Wednesday. Thank you so much for tuning in. I always appreciate it. And I will see you all tomorrow. Bye.